Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we're playing Bingle Bingle. So this is, um, I'm, a, I, I'm sorry, I don't know what this game is called. I don't play, uh, I don't do, I don't go to the casino. I'm not old enough. Um, let's see. Select the ball side of the token to spin the wheel. Is it just called the wheel? I don't know. Um, okay. I've seen this game before, I just don't know what it's called. So we got, oh, a three. Okay, well, three, or ten times ten. How did I get a ten times ten? Ten base points plus twenty. Your score is calculated here. You will score each time you roll a ball. The score is calculated by points times chips. The base points is ten. This is the target score for this round. If you reach target score, the round will be cleared. Be able to move on to the next round. Select the bet side of the token to place chips. If the ball goes into pocket with chips, you will get a higher score. Ah, okay. Each pocket has 10 chips placed by default. Select the color to place 20 chips. Oh. Now 20 chips are added to the selected color, meaning you will get a higher score when the ball goes into pockets of that color. Ah, okay. So that's how this works. The bets placed in each round is shown here. Chips placed by bets last until the end of round. So you can score multiple times with those chips for that round. Honestly, this game is going to go way over my head. So I do apologize if uh, if things do not go very well. 10 times 10. Oh yeah, then plus the 30 and then I got 300. Wow, nice. Uh, after each round, you get some coins and visit the shops. Co uh, shop coins can be spent to upgrade your tokens and wheel. Buy one of the balls with special abilities. For rolling, select a range of pockets where the ball will land. Will a ball freezing pockets nearby? Ah, okay. Token to apply the new ball. I guess go with that. You can also upgrade the level of tokens so you increase the tokens. Wow, okay. After you're done with shopping, click the... Okay, there's so much to this game. Since the ship chips placed last uh, until end of the round, it's usually better to place bets first. Ah, uh, okay, yep, I can I can understand that. The discard button allows you to discard tokens and draw new ones. And then I got my target ball. Now you can test your new ball. Oh, so it just selects a group. A grouping. Okay, let's go there. I did it! And it landed on the red. Oh my gosh, that's gonna be a lot of points, I hope. 450, nice. Um, nine. Okay, you can also upgrade your wheel by buying a new pocket. Oh, when a, to a token reaches a certain level, its abilities are also enhanced. Okay. Bets are sold in the shop, which you can apply to tokens. Uh, okay. Wait, split bet, bet on two numbers. Oh. I should not have done that. Right, all coins disappear when you leave the shop. Okay. Yeah, I should not have done that, but that's fine. I should have gone for the color, it's, but whatever, I kind of forgot. At least it's 10 times 10, yeah. I forgot to bet on a color. Bet on a color. Uh, let's go red. Oh, we got red. Okay, nice. 10 times, so that's 300. Okay. Yeah, um, oh, so you can choose between betting or rolling the ball. Ah, okay, I understand now. Wow, two thousand. I kind of, kind of overkilled that one. Uh, okay. But I understand, I think. These are items available for you to buy in the shop. The item assists your gameplay with their own abilities. First bet of each round have uh, no discard is left. 
Okay. Many items to find with those, you can create many special. Okay. You don't have enough coins. Okay. Uh, oh, I don't really want that. But yes, I under. Okay, I'm, I'm understanding how this works now. So you can just bet, like, a ton on, like, red. And then play this, and you want it to, like, go there. Okay, I understand. I fully understand now how this is how this works. Jeez, okay. From now on, boss will appear every four rounds. Okay, got it. Copy a token from your deck. You can play one more token per round, three more discards per round. Um Copy that one, yeah, sure. Let's just, I mean, let's just turn that. Yeah, there we go. Uh, roll multiple balls fragile. Token is destroyed after use. Destroyed token's gonna be drawn again in that round. Before rolling, select a range of pockets. The ball roll. So I already got, yeah. Well, it's not laying in the same pocket as the registered. What? Buying an upgrade less than twice in the shop, gain 10% more score permanently. So I bought a pocket and an item. After buying or upgrade current stack, and then that gives me plus, okay. Let's go red, because I have a lot of red leaning stuff. I want to go for that little area. It's probably not going to land there. It did. I only got two bets, but that's fine. Are you kidding me? I was 20 points off. I can just roll this. It doesn't even matter where I go. I bet on red, so it's fine. Oh yeah, and the first one is plus 40, so that's actually, yeah, really good. Um, Reaches its base points. Let me bet instead of scoring, gain a round token back. Fragile after a few uses. Okay. I mean, isn't this just the strat, just to kind of fill in the board with the, with one color? I mean, that, it feels like that's the strat. I don't. I mean, maybe I'm wrong, but it's like I just have this whole area just redified, basically. What ball? He landed on 16. Oh. Jeez, almost 6,000 points with that. Okay, nice. We're in a good spot, I would say. Um, be affected by multiple pockets? Oh, that's cool. It's in a pocket containing number two plus five chips permanently. Always added to the chips. Um, oh wait, why, why select five pockets? That doesn't, that seems worse. Huh? <laughs> why would I want that? It doesn't feel like I would want that. I'm so confused. Why is that considered an upgrade? That feels like a downgrade. I 
I'm gonna go in this general area right here. How do I keep landing in that area? I'm, I mean, I'm not complaining, but I'm just... I'm like, am I that good at the game? Oh, I actually got it. Nice. Wait, so after buying your upgrade, less than twice in the shop. Oh, less than twice. Ah. A lot of these are, I mean, actually a lot of these are low. Oh wait, that's not even what I wanted to do. Oopsies. Is that with the number you have the mo? Oh, okay. I mean, I guess that's actually fine. Mm. Yeah, might as well go. Let's go with that. Oh, come on, whatever. Go that general area, please. Uh, is that? Oh, that's a thirteen. Yeah. Could have been better, but that's fine. Got a red. Also, am I? Am I being st Oh, I'm so dumb. Of course it's a You know what? I've completely misunder- I just registered in my brain how the target ball works. It chooses one of the five areas. Oh my gosh. Came for points. So, so I get to choose where the ball lands. So, of course it's an upgrade. How... <sighs> How did I not realize this? So yes, of course reducing the amount would... Oh gosh, I'm so dumb. So that's why it's so freaking good. I'm just gonna roll it because uh, I got black. That's not. Oh, uh, I got a 13 at least, but. You know what? 2730, I'll take it. Could have been worse. Let's go there. But yeah, I'm so dumb. Like, I don't understand how I did not realize that before. That it's betting... 10,000, wow. I'm actually... You guys are more than happy to point out in the comment section of how stupid I am. Oh my gosh. The number of round tokens left is even. I can't believe I was. <sighs> you know what? I I am yeah, whatever. I think I'm beyond help. I don't think anyone can help me at this point. Go there. 
Yeah, of course if it reduces the range, then it's gonna give you more points. Like, duh, that just makes sense. I wasn't so stupid. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. Durr. Of course that makes sense. Round token, uh, run out, revive with three additional round tokens. Winning a column bet. Six numbers horizontal. I just upgrade that. Ah. Uh, whatever, let's just roll there. Got the 13. Didn't matter, because it was just betting on red. But, that's fine. Might not actually get it now. Since that one was like the main one that I've been going for. It's kind of unfortunate though that I got my two strongest tokens right at the start. Yeah. I might be a little screwed, I think. Let's just speed it up. I think I am screwed, yep. Dang. I like the new class though. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I think I'm gonna call it here though. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Bingle Bingle. If you did, please leave a like on it. It's such a funny name. But yeah, please leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. Me and the world to me doesn't cost you guys anything. And yeah, I hope to see you guys in the next one. You guys take care.